Tim here with my day 43 ketogenic diet update and weighing since yesterday or today's weighing um, since the last time I weighed in which was yesterday 0.3 of a kilogram weight loss and that's about sort of six tenths of a pound and so total weight loss now is 9.7 kilograms and that's about 21 and four tenths of a pound since I started 43 days ago so yeah everything's basically on track I know I say that a lot but that's basically how I feel everything's still working nicely and uh, things are going well I saw an amazing video today, and I'm going to put the link in the description of this video. I really suggest you go and watch it. It's about 15 minutes, excuse me with the mosquito flying past me, about 15 minutes long, and it's about um, a doctor who, I think I've actually done a video on him before, Peter Attia, I think is how you spell it, or how you pronounce it, and um, he's talking about basically the, the premise of the talk that he's given. It's actually a TED.com talk, if you're familiar with those sort of talks, and it's about, it basically, to cut a long story short, have we got it wrong about diabetes? And basically, um, he starts off talking about the analogy that most people think of with type 2 diabetes we're talking here, is that obese people, you eat too much and you get diabetes. When what he's saying is it's just basically, it's a condition, it's insulin resistance in your body, which may be causing you to get fat. And he cites some very, very powerful examples, like examples of 6 million people uh, in America who are insulin, resist, uh, insulin resistance, which means insulin doesn't work properly in their body, and they're lean, they're not overweight. So you'd have to say, just based on that, that gives serious doubts as to whether being overweight is actually the cause of diabetes. What he's basically saying is, have we got it reversed? Is, is, is being obese, being overweight, a symptom? So basically, are we blaming the wrong thing, and should we be putting all our research into insulin resistance as opposed to um, you know, losing weight? Amazing, and some really great analogies there. <laughs> the, the analogy that I really liked was if you hit yourself, with, uh, you knock your shin on a coffee table and you get a bruise, um, it's uh, what he's saying is basically analogy, a similar analogy to the weight loss versus uh, you know, gaining weight, being overweight as a result of diabetes. He's, he's basically saying that's similar to you treating the bruise, looking at the bruise and saying that's the cause of the problem instead of actually avoiding the coffee table. So very simple analogy but look, it's definitely worth your time and he gets quite emotional towards the end because he's, he's actually a clinical doctor himself and he's a low carber I know from previous videos he's a low carber so definitely take 15 minutes to watch that video it's very uplifting and I'm very very interested in this he's actually working um, with uh, Gary Torbs as well which is the guy from um, why we get fat and what to do about it he's produced that book and they're working together to actually really try and knuckle down and get the science sorted out for this this has got huge ramifications for low carb um, that I, th I think it has anyway so watch that video the link again is in the video description below this and i'm sure that you'll actually enjoy it all right i'm going to leave it there for today so do check that video out. as i've said a number of times i think it's fantastic and um let me know what you think of it all right i'll talk to you tomorrow Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click this button here. You can see it on the screen now, that's the like button. Please do that, it helps spread the word and get other people to actually find my videos, which is fantastic, it's a win-win. Also, if you want to comment on my videos, please do so, that's over there, right over there. If you do that, I will actually respond to any questions you might have. And lastly, and probably most importantly, please subscribe. That's right, click that button right there now. You can do that right now while I'm talking, and you can subscribe to my channel, and you'll be updated automatically every time I uh, release a new video, which is often. Thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll be back with another video soon. Cheers for now.